Hello everyone. Today we will discuss what is this dynamic related list in Salesforce. So when we are in Lightning App Builder, what is possible for us to do is find a component with name dynamic related list single in the sidebar of standard components. So once we drag and drop it on the page, so it brings us possibility to specify the number of useful settings, which is good for us to have. For example, number of records to display. Also, it's allowing us to select what kind of display type for our component we would like to use. Should it be a list or should it be uh, based on the title? So, and you, as you could see, it's changing. So, uh, also, what is allowing us to do? It's change the actual label of our related list. For example, only published. A related list object and the parent record. So let's imagine that we have business requirements that we would like to show to related list. One of them will show only published records, another one will show every unpublished record. So how we could do so? It's easier for us to do with a dynamic related list because here we have not just visibility settings where we could just hide something and show something, but also we have a filtering conditions. Like for example, in our case, what we could do is we could find a publication status and set it equal to published. So that means that at this moment, this specific related list will show to us only those kind of articles which are related to this specific object, but in the published status. So by the same manner, uh, when we will um, drag and drop another component here, what we will be able to do is we will be able to put here title unpublished. We'll be able to decide the number of records that we would like to show. We will be able to also configure some fields that we would like to show. If it's required for us. Basic sort order, basic sort field, and our filtering condition. In our case, what is required is uh, set publication status to something which is not equal let me find where it's not equal to published so and just it as you could see uh, those components at this moment covering my business use case so I could use dynamic related at least for me to be able to adjust my page layout to make sure that I could show related records with the necessary filtering, with the necessary fields and with the necessary count of records on the page. So thanks for the attention.